They are looking super duper dope. Like, if you don't have Express Bar Line, I don't know what you're still doing with your life in, in this Ghana. Like, Clicking, thank you so much for being here. If you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Inkigali Africa, and you're definitely welcome to my channel. So, guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 4. Um, I'm super, super, super excited for this month of December because, as I said, this month I'm really using it to zoom in on Ghanaian brands, Ghanaian makeup brands for now. Maybe we might include hair and other things, but for now, we're just focusing on the makeup brands right so in my first three videos for vlogmas they want to and three we looked at so aesthetics and we use a few of the products i'm about to review in that but today's video is all about evita joseph right so um they sent me actually went there so they sent, me sent a, a couple of products or they gave me a couple of products right and I went to their studio, I filmed, I'm here to edit it. You probably see that before this. So this will probably be for day five, if not before. And yeah, so Evita Joseph, their packaging is awesome. It is a Ghanaian owned brand. It's owned by Mrs. Evita Joseph Asari. I think so. I think that's the name. Right? So they gave me this product. Their packaging is real cute. You can see the Evita Joseph here branded. Focus man. I don't know why this camera doesn't really like to focus like that, but then ah, I'm sure you guys can see it. And then they gave me um, this brush, this fluffy brush. You guys saw me use it in my previous video for the um SO aesthetics review. And then I also have this ultimate face buffer. You can use I normally I use that as a foundation brush and it works great. And then they gave me three of their brow filler pencils, right? And this is called the Sir Joseph Espet Brow Liner. Yeah. So they gave me in three shades. Um, the lightest shade is called chestnut brown and that's number one um the second is oh okay i didn't get the second one but then the third one is called rich espresso in number three and then there is the midnight drop in number four which is my personal so favorite so i went right. ahead and i swatched the three shades of the espet brow liner that i have on my hand so I'm just going to show you guys in a minute and then you guys can you know make your purchasing decision based on that right so um this one right here I don't know if you guys can see it clearly but then yeah I'm in frame so the first one I have here is the um chestnut brown that's the lighter one this first one here is a chestnut brown. This one is the darkest, the midnight drop. And then this is the rich espresso. So those are the three shades of the Vita Joseph Espet Brow Liner. Um, chestnut brown, midnight drop, and then rich espresso. So I'm going to use the... Hmm, which one should I use today? Which one should I use today? I'm actually liking the espresso too. Okay, so guys, I'll use the espresso for you guys because of I already did a video where I used the midnight drop. So I'm going to go in with. Okay. I'm going to go with the darkest of their brow fillers. They sent me three shades. 
and um, I like my brows really dark so Wow, oh, guys, this is really sealed. And I'm totally loving their packaging options and how they have us, you know, our... Come on, open up. <laughs> guys, the package is so well sealed. It takes a bit to open. So this should tell you that if you buy any Vita Joseph product, right, and it is not properly sealed, then it's fake. So advise yourself this is how it looks like that's it Evita Joseph come on focus focus that's how it looks like and when I open it this is how it should look like okay so now let's do our brows Guys, are you seeing this? This is hands down the best brow pencil or filler whatever I have used. Like it's so perfect. If I get too close, the light's gonna reflect the part I'm using to highlight. But I, I know you guys can see this. Like I've not even added concealer yet, but this is hands down the best defining pencil I have ever used on my face. Like hands down. Right, so I'm going to go ahead and do the other side. Guys, I really want to show you guys the brows. So I'm not going to use concealer on them just yet. I'm going to blend out my powder. Then I'll come back and show you guys how dope this, this is. Okay, like when I'm telling you guys about, you know, African brands made in Ghana brands, Ghanaian owned brands, African owned brands. Y'all be thinking that I'm playing, but I'm not. So... Just a minute, my goodness. So I'm just going to, you know, brush my brows up. Now let's get filled in. Okay guys, so I'm done filling in both brows. And you guys can see how cool they are, right? I've not even concealed them yet. And they are looking super duper dope, like... If you don't have a spitz bar line, I don't know what you're still doing with your life in, in this Ghana, like... Right. And then, they also give me two of their lip glosses. And guys, forgive me, because I used the brushes ahead of time, I took off the packaging it comes in but definitely um take a clip from my old video and you know put it there just to let you guys know how the packaging comes in this is how the brushes come back by the way i just want to show you guys and this is an all over powder okay great and this comes wrapped even though it is sealed so I'm going to take, like every time she said, yo, kudos to you guys. You really put so much thought into your package and I love it. So I'm going to go in with this and I'm just going to buff out the powder. Ooh, that's doing so great. 
and then they gave me two of their lip glosses this is the red one is called striker i was so hyped when they released this like i was so here for it like you guys literally have no idea and then And I've been trying them out so I took out the boxes unfortunately but this is how they look they are super pigmented and beautiful and they gave me four of their eye pigments right so um, this is how it comes like and this one is uh, this one is called Preface and it's like an orangey an orangey brown kind of vibe to it and then this one is called philia it has a reddish this one is called philia and this one has a reddish kind of vibe to it this one is called azios this one has a golden vibe to it right this is easiest and it has a golden vibe to it and then last but not least we have Catharos and this one is yellow gold like it's a little pot of gold that's what I can see so this is how this also looks like focus camera yeah and then this is how it looks like okay so what i'm going to be doing is when i was doing the so aesthetics review i used the vita joseph brushes to demonstrate um some things and to make the video whole so i'm going to be doing the same here i'm going to be using some so aesthetics products and some other products of other Ghanaian brands to show you guys how um a full, how they all work together to bring um a full face <music> 